Hello everybody and welcome to this week's complete singing session. Uh, this is the first singing session video this term featuring the new haircut, uh, which is a wonderful joy. It was so, so nice. I'm sure you know exactly what I mean to get the first haircut for about four and a half months. So, um, yes. Yes, oh, feels so much lighter. So, yes, the usual thing, um, three songs, um, two things I had requests for, and one favourite of mine, which actually I had several requests for last term, but didn't feature. Uh, but yes, as ever, we need to start a quick warm-up. So, um, do an old favourite, and it's C, A, a big long transitional year. C, A, two, three, C. So back down to that, same thing, but this time, C, C, like C air, as in take in the C air, but with a big Y, and you can slide, C, but don't slide up, don't go C, but C, and you can slide back down, and as you slide, drop the jaws, yeah, and really open it for the air, do, and, C. So there's still a y, but this time, rather than opening, it's going to go to, a, to an m. Mm. C um. Really pursed lips, m. Mm. You should feel tingling in your nose. You should bleh, have to do that when you do it. But you see, um, do go. song um, and it's in the mood etc etc uh, you know the tune really well and, and in fact I think most people just assume it, it always was an instrumental um, but there are other words that go with it so it does make it quite a frantic tune because it's really jumping around who's the living dolly with the beautiful eyes so don't do who's the living dolly with the beautiful don't over enunciate each syllable but who's the living dolly with the beautiful eyes lots of sliding together with the beautiful eyes lots of l in it who's the living dolly with the beautiful eyes what a pair of lips I've not what a pair of lips, what a pair of lips, I'd like to try them for size. I'll just tell her, baby, won't you swing it with me? Hope she tells me, maybe, what a wing it will be. And at the end of each line, it's a flicked ending. So eyes and size with me and be. And then it springs you into the next thing. And then, so I said politely, darling, may I intrude? And the way the words are laid out, it looks like there's a gap, but it's So I said politely, darling, may I intrude? She said, don't keep me waiting when I'm in the mood ba -ba 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 -ba. If you think it was, you know, she has muted trump again ba -ba 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 -ba. So she said, don't keep me waiting when I'm in the mood Yeah, in the mood, and a, you know, bones in the neck, and a oh, one of those Let's do that first paragraph Who's the living? One, two, and Who's the living, darling, with the beautiful eyes On a pair of lips I'd like to Politely, darling, may I intrude? She said, don't keep me waiting when I'm in the mood. And I'll try not to even make the words up. I just need to look what they're saying. That's it. And then second paragraph, exactly the same. First I held her lightly and we started to dance. So same thing. 
And if you think, sense of direction, aim for the end of the line. So first I held her lightly and we started to dance. Then I held her tightly, what a dreamy romance. And then it makes sense. If you just go, first I held her lightly and we started to. And da 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 you know. Otherwise it's a bit sort of coconut shells. I'm going to make a Christmas reference, um, even though it's nowhere near, you know. It's not coconut shells and a nativity pen. Like that then. First I held her lightly and we started to dance. Then I held her tightly, what a dreamy romance. And they etc etc. Let's do the second paragraph. Ready? First, two, three. First I held her lightly and we started to dance. Then I held her tightly, what a dreamy romance. And I said, hey baby, it's a quarter to three. There's a Mr. Moon like want to share it with me. Well, she answered, Mr. Don't you know that it's rude to keep my tulips waiting when they're in the moon? So that time, it's three words to fit in at the end of the penultimate line. Well, she answered, Mister, don't you know that it's rude to keep my tulips waiting? Sorry, I've been told off for clapping. Apparently, on some people's sound systems, um, sound systems, some people apparently on iPads in particular, when I clap, apparently it comes out really loudly. I'll, I'll try not to do that. So, but remember the gap. Well, she answered, Mister, don't you know that it's rude to keep my tulips waiting? Do those two lines well too, and well, she answered, Mister, don't you know that it's rude to keep my Tulips waiting when they're in the mood And then it's the in the mood That's what she told me And bring off to mood In the mood That's what she told me in But I wouldn't breathe at the end of the line Otherwise you end up sort of gasping breath So it's in the mood breath That's what she told me In the mood breath And when she told me In the mood And you can slide down to it My heart was skipping But I would breathe there It didn't take me long to say I'm in the mood now ba -ba 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 -ba. We're back onto that So ready? In the mood Two, three In the mood That's what she told me In the mood And when she told me Say I'm in the mood now, in the mood. And same the last paragraph, in the mood, breathe off the moods. For all her kissing, kissing, not kissing, but kissing. In the mood, breathe her crazy loving, in the mood. What I was missing. And just say the last one's really punched out. It didn't take me long to say I'm in the mood now. So you get the hang of it, you know the tune. Yeah, really, really. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, remember they bring off the moods in the mood. And that's what she told. And sense of direction with that first bit. Aim for the end of the line. Be 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 So um yes, all the way through from anybody who's one, two, three. Who's the lady darling with the beautiful eyes? Part of their lips I'd like to try and the size. I'll just tell her, baby, won't you swing it with me? Hope she tells me, baby, what a wing it will be. So I said politely, darling, may I intrude? She said, don't keep me waiting. Energetic one, but hopefully it's nicely got you going. So, um, change of pitch. Yes, lots of requests for this one. Um, the Lord bless you and keep you. It's the John Rutt thing. Um, lovely, lovely little melody. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord. And it's lovely, long, smooth lines. Real contrast. You're just going bat, 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 like that. This is really as smooth as you can do it if you tread one word chewing in for the next. The Lord bless you, Hanneke. Bless you. Not bless. Don't, don't, you know, don't give me a hiss, yes. The Lord bless you, Hanneke. And then it's about shape. It's a beautifully written melody. As it goes higher, you get louder. The Lord make his face to shine. And shine, not shine, not shine. Don't think of it as an I, think of it as an A. The Lord make his face to shine upon you. And then we repeat the words, so the second iteration louder. To shine upon you and be great. 
gracious and make sense of the words to shine upon you breath to shine upon you and to be gracious breath and to be gracious unto you gracious unto gracious unto not gracious so again avoid the hissy s's let's do that first paragraph the lord two three Repeat the whole section. And what I do the second time, just a bit warmer. The Lord bless you and keep you. And exaggerate the shape more. The Lord make his face to shine upon you, to shine upon you and be gracious, and be gracious and to you. It's a lovely melody. It's a lovely melody. Um, if you think of yeah, one of these things that you can you can guess my age and the era I grew up in. If you remember Harry Seacombe doing songs of praise, often at the end of the episode, he'd be wandering around a church lard, church church lard, churchyard, and it would always be bathed in a beautiful sunset. Didn't matter what time of the year. Suddenly he'd go outside and there'd be the beautiful sunset, lovely, lovely rolling countryside in the background, and he'd sing in a very rich and deep way, projecting from there, dropping the voice in the throat. If you think of that, the Lord bless you and keep you. I mean, not not quite like that but you know you get the idea so we've done that tune twice and we get to and be gracious and to you and wrong the bits about the lord lift up the la light light la yeah light so you put an extra vowel in the lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you Yes, countenance upon you. Let's do that one, ready? The Lord, two, three. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you. And again, we've got another iteration of the words. So loud off the second one. The Lord lift up the light of his So okay, but the endings are different. So the first one, the Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you. But the second one stays higher. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you. Let's do those two. The Lord do and the Lord lift up the light of his And then there's lots of and give you peace. Um, and don't get too quiet too quickly. So the first part. And give you a peace. And lean on peace. And give you a peace. And the second one is. And give you a peace. And the third one is. And give you a peace. And the fourth one. And give you a peace. And then it leads you beautifully. You relax them bit by bit. That's why I said don't get too quiet too quickly because they want to gently tail off. And, and I give you a peace for the first one. Then a bit quieter. And I give you a peace. And then quieter. And I give you a peace. And only the last one's really quiet. And I give you a peace. Let's do those ready. And I give. And, and I give you a peace. She's knowing the almond, and there's lots of them. Amen. Can she know it the second one? Amen. And I know what you're going to do. You're going to go, oh my god, that one's high. It's all about there. Remember, eyebrows up, eyebrows up, jaws down. 
jaws, draw down, stomach, pull it in, support it from there. <laughs> lots of them there's lots and lots of them um, and I'll give you as many signals as I can because they're not all the same they start from different beats the bar and song so let's do the amens two three go Last bend, meh. Don't get too quiet. Sometimes you go meh, and it will crack. But meh, long end, and then just let it disappear. Don't do a men no. Don't do some no at the end of it. Meh. Just dissolve and niente into nothing. So lovely, all the way through from the beginning. Probably one of these ones. If you can stand up and do it, be really, really helpful for your breathing. So from the beginning. Bit of job writer actually. I know sometimes people sort of slightly look down on him for writing lovely tunes that people enjoy listening to. Um, but yes, they're beautifully, beautifully crafted. And that one, that one really is a is a re deservedly a favourite. So um, yes, had a lot to request for this. Um, let's just make sure it's not too low. It's a Kesara when I was just a little. And careful of when I was just a little. Don't turn it into you know a when I was just a little. Okay, I asked my mother what... So don't turn it into a drinking song. Um, it's just lovely, lovely. I need to sort out my music over here. It's falling off the music stand. That's uh, so where I've got the window open with the lovely fresh air coming in. It's sort of blowing around slightly. Um, so yes, it's lilting. When I was just a... Not when I was just a little. Um, and basically that's it. You know this. You know this one. Um, when I grew up. Not when I grew up. You know, you're not shouting at the dog when I grew up. When I grew up and fell in love, I asked my sweetheart what lies ahead, etc, etc. And then at the very end, after the last chorus, Que sera, sera, whatever will be, will be, the future's not asked to see. Que sera, sera, what will be, will be. Que sera, sera, goes up. 
And if you go roll yours, que sera, sera. Then lovely. Um, yeah, so just it is lilts through. You know, if you're standing from the Lord bless you and keep you, you can do a lovely You know, really free, lovely, lovely sense of just gently bobbing up and down. So. this week's singing session. As ever, please do carry on sending me suggestions for songs you'd like me to feature over the coming weeks. Otherwise, take care. See you soon. <laughs>